Hello everybody. Today's a special video. It's Saturday 9-11. My memories, our memories, on the 2,996 people who lost their lives on that very horrific day, very sad day. Let me know in the comments below, where were you? Were you living in the same place? Something we'll never forget, something I'll never forget. What were your thoughts in the beginning? Your thoughts an hour later and the thoughts now? I'd like to hear from you. Again, this is a special day as the President Bush at the time was the President of the United States. who was at an elementary school and had a chief of staff whispered in his ear that this tragedy happened at 8.46 a.m. East Coast time, 11.46 West Coast time, and Vegas time. After this video, I would love for you to watch. I put a little clip together. It's about a minute long, a little over a minute. I would appreciate it. I was at the gym that I'm still at now. I was 35 years old, and a lot of you know my birthday's in two days. It was a very difficult time. My wife had dinner reservations on that day on the 11th. Anyhow, I was training somebody. We were doing walking lunges, and I'm not going to get into it. A lot of you know what it is, and we both stopped. At the time, it was those old TVs, not the flat screen TVs in HD now, but you can see and we just looked. We didn't look at each other. We looked for 30 seconds. We stopped, put the weights down, went to the juice bar 50 feet away where there was more people together. We're all looking up on a larger TV. Still old school, of course, but you can see better. At that point, about five minutes, there was some scratching on the face, teardrops. We left. Almost everybody in the, in the health club has left the gym. I went home, my wife left where she was working at the hair salon and then gathered our thoughts and worried. I remember the airport here, Metro, um, McCarran was closed. Casinos didn't know, stratospheres go so high. Anyhow, just a terrible tragedy and it changed the world. So I'm gonna leave you with this video, but I'd like to hear from you and your thoughts. Our prayers and thoughts with the 2,996 people who lost their lives. As I'm watching behind me, Let's keep them in our thoughts forever. And let me know if you knew anybody, family member, my prayers are with you, neighbor, relative, or somebody close. Fire department, police, and everybody. Tough people, those New Yorkers at the time, and in Pennsylvania. May God bless everybody. And I'm again, I'm Sal Capano. I will see you on my next video. And remember, say hello to somebody. Tomorrow's another day. And I'll leave you with this clip that I put together. Ciao.